Oh my god, we're gonna die! One, two, three, Hello, hi, welcome back to my channel, welcome back! I feel like I'm not in focus, but I feel like I am. So hopefully I am. If I'm not, sorry. I'll check in like five seconds. But anyways, I am doing a review of episode 118 of Dragon Ball Super, and I actually really liked this episode. I liked it. I liked it. It had a lot of feels, and I don't know, I liked it. So. Let's just talk about what happened. In this episode, we see Goku, Android 17 and 18 against Universe 2, the rest of Universe 2, the three dudes. Then we have Gohan and Piccolo against the Namekians from Universe 6. So it's kind of like some showdowns against the universes. And the thing is, that's like special, like the thing that is the most important thing is that for Universe 2 and Universe 6, these are their last warriors. So if they lose, they get knocked out, they get eliminated. So really, their whole, like, their lives and the lives of the universe were on their hands. And I was like, I would not go against Gohan and Goku and all those people if I'd probably hide and go against some weaker people. But you know, that's just me. But anyways, that's pretty much the whole episode. There's a hair on my lip. But yes, I actually really, I like this episode. It was really cool. We got to see, okay, there's a hair or something on my lip. We got to see both Universe 2 and Universe 6 kind of pull out their the big guns because they're legitimately the last ones left. If they lose, then their whole universe is gone. And it was really cool because we got to see Universe 2. We saw that they were actually broadcasting the whole tournament to their whole planet universe. It's like, whoa! That would usually cause mass hysteria, but I guess not. The power of love and believing in your team. So through their power and the power of love, the three warriors from Universe 2 actually got to transform and they got to transform into like the love transformations, I don't know, like Rebrian, Rosie, I don't know the last one. And I can't remember, but it was really funny. They're in their little outfits, like Rebrian. It was really funny. And we got to see them like power up like a solid power up and that was cool and then for universe 6 we got to see the Namekians and we saw that they had actually taken the power of all the Namekians who had volunteered to give their power back in their universe so they had like the power of the Namekians on their side and it was like oh man all the power ups but then we have Goku who's like dying universe um, Android 17 18 <laughs> We got to see a funny moment where they're like, I am the goddess 18 and I am here because I have destroyed your goddess Rubrian and it was really funny and Krillin was like, what the, what is happening? But as well we got to see Gohan do some things. Gohan powered up a little bit. He didn't transform Super Saiyan or anything, but he like powered up a little bit and you're like, oh Gohan, watch out. Watch out, are you sure? That's, that might be a little too much for you. I don't know, but we got to see him and Piccolo go at it and I don't know it was just a really cool episode in my opinion. By the end of the episode we do see that Universe 2 and Universe 6 do get eliminated and it actually made me really, really like teary eyed because it was kind of sad to see them go because they've been kind of like a really annoying but a big presence over the last couple many episodes and we see Universe 2 go out in a typical fashion of being like love 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 and you're like you guys and like they didn't even seem phased at all that they were leaving oh my god I'm so sad their whole universe was going to leave and get erased and they just looked so strong and uh and it was and then we got to see universe 6 disappear and chew to what are their names Kale Khalifa Khalifa Khalifla she it was just really cool to see that both universe stayed true to who they were and in their last moments they weren't like oh my god we're gonna die this is the worst thing ever but like they really stayed true to who they were we got to see Kava say goodbye to Vegeta kind of like good luck and Champa and Beerus had this weird goodbye thing and I don't know it made me really like teary-eyed and sad and it, I liked how they went I liked how they made that whole scene go about but we do see Vegeta be pissed at the end and he's like watch out I'm in a bad mood I'm like yes Vegeta are we going to see some epicness from you I hope so and I really want Gohan to go more epic because I'm like my two boys come on come on come on so yes overall I enjoyed this episode I liked getting to see Gohan kind of do a thing and Piccolo and Gohan working together the huge 
Um, I got to, I like to see how Universe 6 and Universe 2 were eliminated. I didn't like to see them eliminated, but I liked the way that they showed them being eliminated and stuff. And I liked the fighting. We got to see, oh, we got to see the really cool Kamehameha from both Gohan and Goku at the same time. That was kind of cool, really cool. And I don't know, it was just a good episode. I liked it. I liked it. But yes, that is the end of my review. So if you liked it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys. You are all amazing, wonderful people. And yeah, I make a bunch of videos a week. And bye.